Hi everybody, Dr. Aulis here. In this short video, we're going to talk about the two ways that your bones can grow, longer and wider. When we're talking about the process of a bone growing longer, we use a process called interstitial growth. Interstitial growth is what we just talked about related to that epiphyseal plate or the growth plate. The way that your bones grow longer is by the cartilage tissue that's in that epiphyseal plate being replaced by new bone tissue. As that cartilage tissue continues to grow and expand, we essentially push down the length of the bone. We're creating new bone tissue as we grow. So when you see the words interstitial growth, interstitial growth means we're pushing our bones longer and using that epiphyseal plate to do that. We also need to grow our bones wider or increase their width. We do this in the diaphysis or the shaft of the bone. So important note, growing our bones longer happens in the epiphyses. Growing our bones wider happens in the diaphysis, the shaft. Growing your bones wider uses a process called appositional growth. And the way that appositional growth works is I have bone building cells on the outside of the diaphysis that put down new bone tissue. As those bone builders, called osteoblasts, put more bone tissue on the outside of the bone, I have bone breaker cells called osteoclasts that are resorbing or breaking down the bone tissue in the middle of the bone. So I add bone tissue to the outside, I get rid of bone tissue on the inside, as I continue to do this, ultimately the diaphysis, the shaft of my bone, gets much wider on the outside and that medullary cavity, that open space on the middle, expands as well. So two different mechanisms that we use to grow your bones. Either appositional growth to make them wider and stronger or interstitial growth to make them longer using that epiphyseal plate.